This video is going to show you how to grade discussion board posts in D2L 10.3. When grading, you have the opportunity to see every post or reply a student made on a specific topic and assign points, either for the entire topic as a whole or for individual posts and replies. The first step to this process is setting up your discussion board topic to be graded. I'm going to set up an existing topic to be graded, but the same process holds when you are creating a new discussion board topic as well. The first thing you need to do is edit the existing topic by choosing Edit Topic from the drop-down menu following the title. Then click on the Assessment tab. From here you can either choose an existing gradebook column to associate with the discussion board topic or you can create a new gradebook item by using this link. You'd give your gradebook column a title, assign the number of points, set any restrictions you want, and then hit Save. Because I already have a column created, I'm just going to choose it from this list here, and I'm going to assign the score out of 10. One other area to pay attention to is this posts area. By default, D2L has you assign one grade per topic, but if you wanted to assign a score to each individual post, you can do that by clicking this checkbox. But since you can only have one grade book column per topic, if you check this box, you need to tell D2L how you want that single column grade calculated, and you're going to choose one of these methods to do that, either by averaging or by using minimums, maximum, or modes, as you can see here. I only want to assign one grade per topic, so I'm going to uncheck this box, and then hit Save and Close. Now I can grade this discussion board. Notice that the text right below the topic title now says includes assessment, which confirms that this topic is now gradable. When I click on this topic menu, I now see an assess topic option. I'm going to click that to begin grading this discussion board. On this screen, I can view and grade individual responses by clicking on the topic score link for the student I wish to assess. Or I can switch to the assessments tab and then click on the student's name to begin grading them. Clicking on the student's name or on the topic score link will bring up a window with every post and reply the student made in this particular topic. From here, I read the posts, I assign a grade by typing a number in the topic score box, I can add additional feedback if I wish, and then I click Save and Close. Now you may have noticed there was a Publish to Grades button on that previous window. I can either click that window to make this score visible to this particular student immediately, or I can wait till all of the posts are graded, and then here at the top I can click Publish All Scores to Grades to release grades and feedback for the entire class at once. Once I've done this, to see feedback for this grade, the students will simply click on the Grades link in their course.